through the poppy seed mountains in the quaint animal village of Huffing Guild Springs lives a chipper young rabbit who was quite possibly the happiest rabbit that ever lived. His name was Spunkles. Spunkles the rabbit. Oh, what a beautiful day it is! Makes me want to go on holiday! Oh, look over there! It's me mate Wallaby! Spunkles carefully skipped over to his old pal Wallaby. Hello, Wallaby! Oh, what's wrong with you? I'm just sitting on me sad stump. No need to be sad on a day long today! But I'm waiting for me girlfriend. She said it was important. Well, how long are you gonna wait for that, bird? She said she'd be here in a couple of ticks after an hour. Well, we got all the time in the world! Let's go! But where are we? We're at your favorite place! Home? The beach! But it's winter, and the cold hurts me joints. Nonsense! Look! We're the only ones here! But I just want to be back and wait for me girlfriend. Well, I've got just the place for you! Oh, I love the pub! It's my favourite place in the whole world! Don't you agree, Wallaby? Reminds me of me pup. He was born, he worked, he drank, he died. Oh, what a lovely story! Look, mates! It's your spunk on his raid in his mom's wardrobe again! No! <laughs> Was your mom special present for me last night, you sloppy cunt? Oh, I really hate that raccoon. Winker he is. Sometimes I just want to slit his throat. What if she's there waiting? Don't need to worry, jolly good time ahead! I just want to go home. I really, really hate you. <laughs> oh, those group of fellas, they want to give me all this quid. My girlfriend never showed. Telegram for Wallaby. Rabbit. This is Wallaby. My best mate here is. I didn't expect an actual rabbit to be here. Or hate England. Well, open it up now. It's from me girlfriend. Dear Wallaby, I waited, I waited, I waited. I never want to see you again. Cheers. Good to hear she's doing all right. Well, at least we still have each other. Spunkles awoke several hours later. Inside of a coffin. What's this? No! 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 But you're dead. Nonsense, mate! Or could have leave me old pal Wallaby behind? Much more adventures to be had! We'll be together! Forever. No. Every year, the peaceful folks of the Poppy Seed Mountains get together for the annual Huffingfield Springs picnic. Don't you just love these events? We either the flowers, Wallaby! But I'm allergic. Come now, just one. But Spunkles, the last time. <laughs> oh, Wallaby, you silly bastard! You blew away all the pretty petals! Let me just go forward you another! <laughs> no, not again. Excuse me, coming through, pardon your tits, thank you. Is that Winston Gorgthrop? Boy, guy, it is! Tell me, chap, still coach the lads at the Gaelic football team? <laughs> oh, 
real shame that is. A hundred feet from the lad, you say? <laughs> Don't blame yourself, mate. Those blokes' trousers get shorter every year. <laughs> Cheers. Achoo. Oh, hello there, Wallaby. Pardon me, Miss Meadowlark, but I need some medical. Oh, Miss Famous Peanut Butter Cookies. <laughs> You'll just die and join them. Spunkos, have you ever thought about having kids? Thought never occurred to me. Well, God damn it! Who's going to take care of you when you're older? Will it be, I suppose? You Nazis got one of their modern relationships going on or something? He's just my bestest friend in the whole world! Well, that's okay, I suppose. But you see me lad Billy over there? When I've got Alzheimer's shitting myself in a wheelchair and watching reruns of Antique Roadshow, he'll be there taking care of me, miss. Oh, you talking about that, lad? Yes, goddammit. I don't think he'll be taking care of you whatsoever. What? Hold that thought. My, my, my! Mr. Raccoon! Oh, hello, Spunkles. Uh, how have you been? Lovely. But oh, I've had some rather troublesome news lately. Maybe you can help clarify. Uh, wh- <laughs> wh- what do you mean, mate? <laughs> Chatter around the tea stool is some sloppy low browed cunt has gone mad into me home. This bloke from where I hear has a big bushy tail, pointy nose, and an old green hat. Sound familiar? <laughs> well, no, um, I can't say I know the fellow. Of course it is wankers living in me home. Or oh, could a go and make fish and chips out of him? I need him! <laughs> Wallaby. Oh, hello, Frank. Have you had me wife's meat paws yet? No, but I'm quite all right. Valerie! You bring your fat bum over here and give Wallaby a taste of your pie. It's about the only thing this bench good for, other than the old in and out, if you know what I mean. (laughs) Here you go, Frank! That's the wrong pie. (sighs) Go back and make it right. Do it yourself, you piss artist! At least it would be the way God intended. Was that really necessary? Yes. That's the problem with the world these days. People lack discipline. Father, why must you and Mother always fight? Now, how do you expect to be the best player on the team when you're talking instead of playing? (laughs) See? Discipline. That boy has the highest grades, he's the star of the team, and he's mostly pretty respectful. He'll make a lot of money and take care of me when I'm older. I wouldn't count on that. Whiplash! Whiplash! I know you're here! Hello, gentlemen. I'd like to personally welcome you to the Huffing Guild Springs picnic. Oh, stop fucking fucking shot me! Shut up, bird! Whiplash! Get out here! Oi! I've traveled all over the globe to find your carrot picking ass. You're gonna pay for what you did to Pablo and Ray's. Now, Doofus, you speak in the past tense too much. Here, Mom. Just be combat! No! <laughs> oh, tell you he wouldn't take care of you. Hello, Mr. Rabbit. I must say, you had a rather reckless day. I should warn you for the future to avoid any strenuous activities, especially with your allergies. I don't mean to, love. Don't mind me asking, but... How are those picnics? I've always wanted to go, 
but my allergies make me so dizzy. Loud, noisy, and filled with death. I'd rather be home. Reading poetry and sitting on me sad stump. You... you have a sad stump too? Of course, me favorite book to read on it is... The Sad Sad News Clown? How did you know? I just took a guess. I don't usually do this, but... Y y yes Would you like to go out to the... Oh, I don't know, maybe get a spot of tea? 